Hello, it's David with the Price Group at Coldwell Banker, and I'm stood out in front of a new listing that we have at 1186 Terrace North in St. Petersburg in the beautiful Barclay Estates neighborhood. The property is a four bedroom, three bath, two car garage, pool home with a spillover spa. I'm gonna take you on a quick tour around the property. Home recently had uh, lots of different upgrades in it, including a new roof, new poured concrete driveway, new two car garage door, which has a, uh, a fake faux wood look to it, which is quite beautiful. We have brick pavers up to the front of the house. The uh, windows to the left of the door were just replaced with insulated windows. House features tile floors throughout the main living area here. And then we have wood floors in the family room and a couple of the bedrooms. Property has two master suites in a split floor plan configuration. So here in the formal living room, we've got uh, windows out here facing the front of the property. We've got the dining room there, large living room, and then sliding glass doors out to the swimming pool. Then we have the junior suite. So we come in through some small double doors and we have a nice size bedroom here, easily accommodated king size bed with sliding glass doors out to the pool. We've got a walk-in closet here. And then we have the vanity area. And then what's neat about this floor plan is we have a door then that separates the uh, toilet and sh tub shower combination. So that's the junior suite, and we'll head through towards the dining room. What I quite like about this home is how we've got designated rooms. So many homes today are all open floor plan. Um, this one has a combination of both an open floor plan off of the kitchen, and we have a, a dry bar here, and we'll head through towards the kitchen, family room, and uh, obviously you can see now there's a small table in here. So really this is that open concept that a lot of people like today, but then you do have uh, a separate formal living room and formal dining room so that you know you can split children up. This is a four bedroom house after all, so it certainly would accommodate a large family. We've got uh, natural gas for the stove and oven, and we've got all stainless steel appliances, granite countertops, beautiful. Let me show you the ceiling in here beadboard ceiling with recessed lighting. And what I do like about this house is this whole stainless steel backsplash here. Makes it very easy to clean up. We've got uh, a window here off of the um, sink area that goes out onto another granite countertop in the pool. And we've got quite a large pie-shaped lot. And what's unique about this property, I don't know if you can see it from this angle, just beyond the uh, spillover spa, we've got your own private shuffleboard court. We'll see a little bit more of that when we go outside. Again, back to the family room. And then we have a two-car garage. Laundry is out here in the garage. We've got a gas hot water heater, as well as a gas-fired air conditioning furnace. Um, the dryer could be connected to gas or electric. Current dryer that's in place and is sold with the home is electric, but that could be changed out. Lots of storage in this house. Storage closet here. There's another one back uh, this way. And we've got uh, guest bedroom number one. This would make a perfect home office. It's probably in the 11 by 11 range, so it would easily accommodate a queen size bed. And then we have a doorway here that connects into the second bedroom. But rather than walk through, I'm going to show you another way to get there. More sliding glass doors out to the pool. We'll come back to that. So second guest bedroom would come down this hallway. And they would come into the room this way. This room, I'd say, is about 12, almost 13 foot wide. And again, about 11 foot deep. There's double closets in this room right here, 
and behind the door. And of course, we did mention it's a kind of that Jack and Jill bedroom. So if you've got a couple of kids that uh, get along, this would be ideal. They can come back and forth to each other's rooms. And then we have the guest bathroom, single vanity, a, an interesting uh, deep tub here. Nice tile with a couple of niches in for shampoos and so forth. Beadboard halfway up the walls, and then we go into the large master bedroom. So this would be the fourth bedroom. Just look how big this room is. Easily accommodated king size bed, and you could have your own living space back here um, if you wanted to. Master bathroom, double vanity. We have a uh, nice walk-in shower. And then Something you don't see much of here in Florida is a large closet. This is all fully built out. And this room also has two additional closets. There's one over here. And then a second one right there. Again, sliding glass doors out to the pool. So we have four points of entry to the pool from the house. Big corner property. Bird cage pool, so you're not going to be bothered by any bugs back here. There's your uh, private shuffleboard court. Fun thing to do when you have a few people over. You've got that spillover spa, which is uh, heated by a gas heater. I believe this is a travertine deck. Again, these sliding glass doors are off the junior suite. These sliding glass doors are off the formal living room. We have the window here from the kitchen, so you can be serving food out here. We have the sliding glass doors from the family room, and then the sliding glass doors which we came out of from the master bedroom. And this is going to conclude our tour. If you would like to set up a private tour of the house to come and experience it for your for yourself, we'd be more than happy to create a, uh, a time for you. Uh, we will be having several open houses on this property, so please check back to our website, which is pricegrouprealtors.com. Thanks very much, and uh, have a great day.